electronic effects. So electronic effects are two types. So one is the polarization effect. Polarization effect. So another one is the polarizability effect. Polarizability effect. So polarization, it is caused by the cations. It is permanent effect. It is a permanent effect, uh, but it is caused by the negative ions. Here it is the, the temporary effect. Temporary effect. So the polarization, like permanent effects are mainly, so it is uh, like, uh, it leads to the inductive effect. Now the second one is mesomeric effect. The third one is uh, HC. Hi hyperconjugation. Third one is hyperconjugation. These three are the permanent effects. Now the, like a polarizability effects, those are inductomeric effect inductomeric effect like a electromeric effect electromeric effect hi everyone welcome to the rp resonance chemistry now let us continue our lectures on general organic chemistry that is goc chemistry series this is the lecture number five okay today we are going to discuss about like an inductive effect that is nothing but a, one of the electronic displacement effect in covalent bonds so inductive effect was uh, discovered by the like in gold scientist in gold now let's move on to the topic that is nothing but the inductive effect okay now here simply it is the let us take this some of the example that is nothing but a ch3 ch2 ch2 ch3 let us assume okay so this is the n butane okay simple hydrocarbon simply hydrocarbon these are the non-polar compounds there is no polarization non-polar compounds okay now whenever these compounds which are connected through the like a either one of the more electronegativity atom or which are connected through the less electronegativity atom that is nothing but metals okay more electronegativity atom means it pulls the electron cloud towards itself so here the bond into two electrons it pulls the electron cloud towards itself so now here it is the less electronegativity atom means uh, so now here it lowers the electron cloud towards away away from the away from itself okay so that means uh, here the carbon chain which pulls the electron cloud towards itself now here halogen which pulls the electron cloud towards uh, uh, itself okay so this is the halogen group this is the like um, uh, like a less electronegativity atom group okay now whenever the compounds which are connected to the either more electronegative or less electronegative it becomes uh, it uh, non polarity will destroy it. then it becomes a polar molecule then be it becomes polar molecules now here the like a uh, displacement of sh like a simply shifting of uh, sigma sigma electrons shifting of sigma electrons uh, either towards the group or away from the group towards the group or away from the group uh, it is observed in case of uh, like any type of org organic chain molecule carbon chain molecule then it is simply it is nothing but an uh, uh, inductive effect okay now i'll give the complete uh, uh, like a concept of uh, inductive effect many of the students they are confused with these type of uh, like uh, uh, statements okay now let's go, let's move on to the simple topic so this is the like a carbon compound so here in case of carbon compounds all carb all compounds are similarly having the same electronic cloud so whenever whenever the carbon compounds which connected through the like a uh, a uh, more electronegativity atom let us assume it okay now uh, here in case of a more electronegativity atom the bonded to electrons so shifted towards uh, like a uh, abstracted towards uh, itself then it becomes more electronegative then it becomes more electronically clouded okay then automatically the carbon atom will become less electronegative so the remaining are seems to be like uh, similar okay la la this is our assumption okay so here x that is the x minus which affected the halogen group which affected the first carbon okay now here it is the like less electronic cloud less electronic uh, cloud so now the remaining carbons uh, cannot stop over there okay like a uh, human beings uh, it is also it having also a helping nature so it can donate uh, the electronic cloud towards the like a uh, less electronic uh, less electronic cloud atom so then automatically it increases the electronic cloud it decreases okay similarly so now here the second atom which is uh, uh, like which is affected which acquires the less electronic cloud then automatically third atom which, which donates the electronic cloud towards the second atom towards the second atom so this is the like helping nature so now here halogen which can affect the first carbon but these first carbon induced by the carbon chain along the carbon chain those induced is called as inductive effect those induced of the carbon chain those induced of the carbon chain along the carbon chain it is called as inductive effect i think it is clear okay it is better than the uh, previous statement okay now here it is the like inductive effect it is nothing but inductive effect now here it it affects it effectively works up to three carbons only up to 
three characters. That means uh, here it is the like uh, up to this the inductive effect is absorbed. Uh, more than that, uh, inductive effect is uh, uh, like uh, destroyed. That means uh, it is uh, ineligible. Okay. Now here up to three characters. Now here the more electronegativity atom. It, it means uh, here it is the electron two electrons shifted towards the halogen atom. Then automatically it becomes a partial negative charge. It becomes a partial positive charge partial positive charge now let's move on to the move on to the carbon chain the positive character decreases move on to the positive side the positive character will decreases like similarly here uh, metal gets positive charge and carbon gets the partial negative charge so moving on to the like a carbon chain now negative charge decreases negative charge decreases this is the like a uh, inductive effect so that means a uh, magnitude of the charge clearly explains uh, the magnitude of the charge is inversely proportional to the distance is inversely proportional to the distance if distance increases magnitude of the charge decrease this is the basic introduction now let's move on to the like a uh, concept of in, uh, like a uh, uh, classification of inductive effect okay now let's move on to the like a classification this is the inductive effect so now based on the like a uh, uh, like effective nature of the groups or nature of the groups it is classified two types so one is the like a positive inductive effect or plus i effect another one is the like a minus i effect another one is the minus i effect simply it is nothing but a negative inductive effect negative inductive effect so like a positive negative is nothing but a so if let us assume here it is the group it is the carbon atom okay now here the halogen group uh, which uh, which pulls the electron cloud towards itself which pulls the electron cloud towards uh, itself and now here it uh, withdraws the electronic cloud now those type of groups are electronic withdrawing groups electronic uh, withdrawing groups so now here it lost their uh, positive electronic cloud character but adjacent groups can donate their electrons uh, then it is called donating groups okay now the inductive effect uh, uh, like a uh, allotted with these two terms that is one is a donating groups another one is a withdrawing groups based on that uh, so here it is classified two types so whenever which is caused by the caused by the electron withdrawing groups electron withdrawing groups so that uh, this is nothing but which uh, pulls the electron cloud towards itself now here which is caused by the electron donating groups electron donating groups this is the like a basic term okay now let's move on to the like a different order of the these plus i and minus i effect okay now here uh, this is the minus i effect uh, that is nothing but uh, here minus i effect okay now uh, it may be like a uh, here it is the more electronegativity atom so here if more electronegativity atom is there here it is the positive charge then it, it favors for the like nucleophilic uh, like a nucleophilic uh, that means a nucleophilic uh, substitution reactions okay now i don't want to go for the each and every uh, like a uh, mechanism now let's move on to the our concept only okay i don't want to go for the broad things okay now here it is the like a uh, minus i effect order minus i order so here this is the order or2 plus now nr3 plus okay so positive over the nitrogen atom so nh3 plus now no2 then uh, like it is a uh, so3h so3h then cyanide so then automatically like here it is the aldehyde ketone okay then it is the like a cooh carboxylic acid then like acid halides acid chlorides then it is a uh, like uh, esters then finally it is amide amide functionality after this is, is the carboxylic acid groups then after uh, like halogens are uh, comes now here fluorine chlorine bromine iodine like a uh, or oh then h2 or nr2 like an h2 nr2 then c6 h5 hydrogen okay so these like a, a minus i effective order which is calculated with the help of hydrogen now here hydrogen is the like a standard compound hydrogen is the standard compound now from uh, first to ending first uh, that means top to ending so minus i effect order decreases minus i effect order decreases okay now here it decreases the minus i effect order that means uh, so top of the molecules which uh, pulls the electron cloud towards itself very uh, like vigorously now bottom of the molecule which pulls the electron cloud very lessly okay now let's move on to the like plus i effect so here it is the which is caused by the donating groups so donating groups is nothing but uh, mainly alkyl group mainly alkyl groups the best examples 
alkyl groups. So in case of alkyl groups, many of the alkyl groups are there like a, a methyl, like a C2H5, ethyl, C3H7, propyl, C4H9, butyl. Okay. Now here, uh, th this is the like a group CH3. All are the hydrogen atoms. All are the hydrogen atoms. And now here in case of uh, ethyl, here it is the like two hydrogen atoms. One is CH3. Like here CH3, CH3, H. Now here all are the methyl groups. All are the methyl groups. This is the like a tertiary methyl group. Now methyl, ethyl, propyl, tertiary methyl. This is the atom. Okay. Now if one group is there, one group is there, then inductive effect is present. One alkyl group is present, then inductive effect is present. Now on this group, so like a number of alkyl groups increases. That means uh, the bulkiness of the alkyl group increases automatically plus the effect increases. So bulkiness increases. To bulkiness increases plus i effect increases plus i effect increases this is the like first point regarding to the like our compounds now uh, based on this point uh, which is the more plus i effect either tertiary butyl or methane absolutely tertiary butyl this is the order okay tertiary greater than secondary greater than primary greater than methyl so this is the order of a plus i effect this is the order of plus effect not only this uh, many of the compounds like a very simple compounds that is nothing but um, like a uh, branched compounds okay now here it is the compound uh, so this is the like a uh, normal butyl okay now here it is the tertiary butyl let us assume here it is the tertiary butyl group okay here it is the like a normal butyl group so in case of uh, like uh, both are same both are same or different compounds are present whatever it may be so now number of branches increases uh, plus i effect increases now the third point number of branches increases plus i effect increases plus i effect increases this is the like a uh, third point in uh, our plus i effect okay this is the like a uh, plus i and minus i effects so plus i effects is nothing but electron donating groups minus i effect is nothing but uh, like electronic withdrawing groups electronic uh, withdrawing groups okay now let's move on to the what is the applications what are the applications regarding to the our inductive effect okay i think it is clear now let's move on to the applications of uh, inductive effect so like a uh, seven or eight applications are there now let us discuss the um, those applications one by one very clearly. Okay, now let's move on to the applications of inductive effect. Applications. Okay, so the first application. So several applications are there, stability of carbocation, stability of carbonyl, acidic strength of acids, acidic strength of alcohols, basic strength of amines, okay. Now some of the reactivity order of halides, again dipole movement, these type of uh, effects are there. But now let us discuss the one by one. So the first one is uh, stability of carbocation. Stability of carbocation. Now, with the help of uh, like uh, either pa pa plus i groups or minus i groups, uh, stability, what will happen in case of carbocation? Okay. Now, the simple the simple thing. So, plus i groups. Why? Because here it is the donating groups. So, carbocation is vacant orbital. So, vacant orbital, that means a deficient compounds. So, donating groups can stabilize the uh, like a carbocation, can stabilize the carbocation. But withdrawing groups, which can uh, pulse the electron cloud. Now, in case of uh, like a carbocation, it is electronically deficient species. Now, whenever which is connected to the like a donating groups, that is releasing groups which can releases the electron cloud towards itself then it can stabilize it but in case of uh, like a carbocation with a withdrawing group uh, withdrawing group uh, again uh, it is a uh, it obstruct the electron cloud without any like uh, humanity okay so now with, with which obstruct the electron cloud towards itself then it becomes it is more positive more positive means destabilized okay so now simply plus i groups or donating groups increases the carbocation stability and minus i groups decreases the carbocation stability plus i groups increases the carbocation stability so one statement is enough okay so if uh, like uh, one statement is enough for the like remembering of those those type of compounds okay now so here automatically minus i groups it decreases the carbocation stability okay now let's move on to the different different carbocations here it is the methyl 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 carbocation so then here it is the hydrogen methyl methyl carbocation so then it is the hydrogen, hydrogen, methyl, carbocation. 
then it is the hydrogen 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 carbocation okay so four carbocations are there okay now here all are the hydrogen atoms hydrogen is the reference compound there is no inductive effect why because it is the reference compound like a uh, glyceraldehyde in carbohydrates uh, like atomic mass for sweet fall mass like that so here inductive effect measured by the like a standard of uh, like our hydrogen atom so there is no effect okay now here it is the three hydrogen atoms so it is a uh, like a normal compound zero level okay now whenever in presence of methyl group alkyl groups of the plus i groups okay plus i groups either increases the carbocation stability or decreases the carbocation stability absolutely it increases the carbocation stability that's why so presence of plus i groups it is more stable than the first one it is more stable than the last one so okay now here let's move on to the left side so now here methyl and methyl two methyl groups that means uh, plus i groups increases carbocation stability automatically increases so this is more stable than that of the previous two okay now finally here three methyl groups are there so three methyl groups it, it is more and more carbocation stability that's why so this is the stability order of carbocation stability order of carbocation simply tertiary is more stable than the secondary secondary is more stable than the primary primary is more stable than the like methyl carbocation methyl carbocation now let's move on to the like second record i think it is clear any if if there is any doubts please mention in the comment box so now let's move on to the second one so that is the like a stability of a carbon ion stability of carbon ion stability of carbon ion now let's move on to the carbon ion so here if if it is the carbon ion so then like uh, all uh, donating groups are there donating groups uh, releases their electronic cloud now here it, itself it having the electrons so those uh, two electrons that means uh, electrons between the like uh, releasing groups and the uh, carbon ion repel to each other then it is destabilizing so in case of uh, like uh, withdrawing groups uh, which can uh, stabilizes the these uh, negative uh, negative atom that means why because it, it pulls the electron cloud okay now here in presence of plus i groups it repels to each other due to the repulsion here it is the destabilized okay so that is the point so minus i groups increases the carbon ion stability then automatically plus i groups decreases the carbon ion stability carbon ion stability and similarly like uh, according to our previous examples this is the methyl 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 tertiary methyl group like it is a uh, like isopropyl group isopropyl carbon ion this is the like ethyl carbon ion now here it is the all our hydrogen atoms so this is methyl carbon ion okay these are the four atoms are there four carbon no, four uh, carbon ion atoms are there okay now here there is no plus a group okay so in case of minus a group it increases there is no plus a group it is neutral so this is the like a neutral one now in case of methyl so here it is the presence of plus a groups so in case of stability of carbocation plus a groups either increases or decreases absolutely it decreases the carb carbon ion stability that's why the presence of methyl group the presence of plus a groups it decreases the carbon ion stability so that's why last one is more stable than that of the third one okay now again here two methyl groups are there two alkyl groups are there two plus i groups are there that's why here it is the more like less stable than that of the second one so now here three groups are there that's why it is a very very less stable than the remaining three ones now here order of the stability like this order of the stability quite opposite to the like carbocations now let's move on to the third factor that is the relative strength of acids relative strength of acids okay very simple thing okay. now here in case of acids here it is the carbon like a carboxylic acid here it is the carbon uh, like uh, it is a negative charge over there negative charge over there okay now in case of uh, like withdrawing groups here it pulls the electron cloud now now here in the presence of negative charge so if it is carbon is positive then only these two are the like resonated so in case of uh, like a carbon becomes a negative so these two are repelled then carbon carboxylate ion is destabilized that's why so here carboxylate carbon is positive then only it is stabilized so which which type of groups which can creates the positive charge over there so definitely whenever in the presence of withdrawing groups then only it creates the positive charge otherwise if donating groups are present so if which can donate the pair of electrons their electronic cloud towards the carbon atom then it becomes a more electronically rich okay so that is the like destabilization that's why here minus i group similarly carbon ion so minus i groups increases acidity increases simple point so then automatically quite opposite word is plus i groups increases plus i groups increases acidity 
decreases okay now let's take the some of the uh, simple examples regarding to the these acids okay okay now let's go through a sim simple example so that is the very simple CHCOOH, CH3COOH, C2H5COOH, C3H7COOH. So this is the like labeled as A, B, C, D. Okay. Now here, this is the carboxylic acid. So hydrogen is the canamer one. Okay. So in presence of a methyl group, methyl is plus I group or minus I group? Plus I group. Plus I groups either increases or decreases the acidity. So decreases the acidity. Okay. Now here the presence of a plus I group, it is a lesser acidic than the first one. Okay. It is lesser acidic than the first one. Now here ethyl group, that means uh, uh, bulkiness increases, plus I effect increases. So bulkiness increases, plus I effect increases, acidity of carboxylic acid decreases. Okay. That's why it is less acidic than that of the B. Okay. Now finally here it is the more and more bulkiness. It is less, uh, less acidity. So that's why acidity added like this. A greater than B greater than C greater than D. So this is the caused by the plus I groups. Now let us take the another example which is caused by the like minus I effect. So now here it is the CH3 COOH simply. Now CH3, CH2 fluorine COOH CH2 chlorine COOH now CH2 like a bromine COOH okay now CH2 iodine COOH okay these are the four, five examples so which is which is which are labeled as A B C D E okay now here the presence of minus I groups acidity of carboxylic acid increases now here it is the there is no minus I group that's why it is least stable all groups are minus I groups so among the among the four minus I groups the, the, some order is there according to the, our minus I order so here fluorine is greater than that of the chlorine chlorine is greater than that of the bromine bromine is greater than that of the iodine so that's why which is more minus I group so fluorine is the more minus I group that is the that's why it is the more acidic in nature okay now here B greater than that of the C C greater than that of the D D greater than that of the E but uh, originally A is the less acidic than that of the all those things okay so this is a like a acidic order in the presence of minus I group so now let's move on to the third thing in relative strength, uh, relative strength of acids so that is in case of uh, like aromatic acids and uh, aliphatic acids what will happen okay now let's move on to the like a uh, comparison of aliphatic and aromatic acids comparison of aliphatic and aromatic acids now here the presence of CH3COOH that is a uh, like uh, any type of alkyl group so this is a uh, alkyl group this is the like a uh, aromatic C6H5 that is benzoic, uh, benzoic acid okay now here benzene is the like a minus I group so according to the our order this is the minus I group so R is the plus I group so minus I groups increases the stability when compared to the plus I groups that's why aromatic acids are always stable than that of the aliphatic acids aliphatic acids now again uh, R group is the like a uh, this is the order like hydrogen minus I groups so this is the plus I groups okay so this is the order this is the reference so which are having the more effective more effective than the hydrogen then it is minus I so less effective then it is uh, then it is the plus I groups okay now here plus I hydrogen is the better than that of the plus I groups that's why HCOOH is greater than that of the like RCOOH again so here aromatic acids are there that is a negative charge okay now here aromatic acid aromatic acids are less stable than the hydrogen why because hydrogen there is no any type of effect so that's why finally HCOOH is greater than that of the aromatic acids aromatic acid is greater than that of the aliphatic acid okay are you clear okay Aromatic acids are like uh, greater than that of the aliphatic. So, uh, 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 formic acid which is greater acidic than that of the aromatic as well as uh, aliphatic acid. Aromatic as well as aliphatic due to the presence of a hydrogen group. Presence of a hydrogen group. Okay. Now, let's move on to the fourth application that is nothing but uh, like uh, acidic strength of uh, alcohols. Acidic strength of uh, alcohols. Okay, now this is the like a fourth point acidic strength of alcohols. Okay, now here here also plus I groups decreases, decreases the acidity. Okay, plus I groups decreases the acidity, minus I groups like a uh, increases the acidity, increases the acidity. This is the order. Okay, now in case of like a methyl, methanol, ethanol, not ethanol, it is ethanol. 
okay c3h7 oh propanol like this okay this is the comp this is the like um, alcohols okay now here it is one only one plus i group here two plus i groups so three plus i groups that means uh, bulkiness increases plus i effect increases if plus i effect increases uh, acidity decreases plus i groups increases acidity decreases that's why a b c so a is greater than that of the b greater than that of the c why because a is the less number of plus i groups uh, more acidic in nature like in case of uh, like a presence of uh, CH3OH, CH3OH like this, okay, CH3OH, now here it is the another CH3OH, okay, this is connected through the fluorine, this is connected through the chlorine, this is connected through the bromine, this is connected through the iodine, okay, these are the like a fluoro alcohol, fluoromethanol, like a chloromethanol, bromomethanol, iodomethanol, okay, so among the four, so according to the minus I effect order, minus I groups increases the acidity of alcohols, that's why A, B, C, this is the labeling of uh, these compounds, uh, A having the more minus I effect order group, that's why A is greater than that of the B, B is greater than that of the C, C is greater than that of the D, in similar way, so in case of aromatic alcohols and the aliphatic alcohols, so here it is the phenol, so aromatic alcohol, this is the alcohol, this is the minus I group, this is the plus I group, so due to the minus i group uh, minus i group increases the acidity of alcohol that's why aromatic alcohol is greater than that of the like aliphatic alcohol aromatic alcohol is greater than that of the aliphatic alcohol like a minus i groups aromatic alcohols is more stable than that of the aliphatic alcohols now in, in presence of uh, like a uh, aromatic alcohol in water in previous case carboxylic acid that is a uh, only hydrogen group is there that's why it is more resonating structure that's why it is more acidic now here aromatic alcohols in presence of minus i group it is more acidic than that of the water okay it's quite opposite to the like in pre previous one okay so this is the order now let's move on to the like a complete order of alcohols the aromatic alcohols is greater than that of the water what is more acidic than that of the aliphatic alcohols water is more acidic than that of the aliphatic alcohols now i'll give the complete uh, series of those acidic strength of uh, acids and alcohols so first of all it is started with the formic acid is more acidic than that of the like aromatic acids the, like benzoic acid which is more acidic than that of the aliphatic acids acids are more acidic than that of the alcohols that's why then uh, like uh, alcohols it is aromatic alcohols then of water so then it is the alcohol simply it is nothing but aliphatic alcohol this is the complete order of the like different acidic strength of acids and carboxylic acid now let's move on to the another thing that is the fifth one like a basic nature of amines i think it is clear not done very clearly Now let's move on to the uh, like a fifth one, but is the basic strength of a plus i groups. Ba basic strength of plus i groups. Basic strength of plus i groups. Okay. So now here, in case of amines, here basicity is uh, observed. So that's why uh, quite opposite. Plus i groups increases the basicity. Minus i groups decreases the basicity. Why? Because so basic nature, the presence of uh, more and more electronic cloud donation, here it increases the electron density. That's why it acts as a like more electron uh, electron donor. Okay. So that's why it is more basic in nature. So plus i groups increases basicity of amines. Basicity of amines increases. It's quite opposite. Minus I groups increases. Basicity decreases. Basicity decreases. These are the two major points uh, uh, common in each and everything. Okay. Now here, uh, based on this, uh, like uh, acidic strength or basic strength, it is a reversal. Okay. Now here, like uh, it means NH3, like NH2R, RNH2, R2NH, R3NH. So in case of like a R is equal to methyl, it is gaseous phase. It is a gaseous phase, uh, like a, a methylamine, uh, dimethylamine, trimethylamine. These are the gas, gaseous phase. Okay. Now here in presence of gaseous phase, uh, so more and more number of alkyl groups are present. More number of alkyl groups is nothing but plus I groups. If plus I groups increases, uh, basicity increases. So that's why tertiary amine is more basic than that of the secondary. Secondary is more basic than that of the primary. Primary is more basic than that of the amine. So this is the order which is observed in the like in case of uh, uh, gas gaseous state in case of gaseous state okay so r sometimes they are given in the like a chlorobenzene state a chlorobenzene is also the gaseous form okay now let's move on to the like the aqueous solution many of the students they are confused with the aqueous state of uh, uh, like a basicity order of uh, n-links okay so this is the like previous year uh, like a uh, great question and uh, j means uh, on the advanced questions okay this is the like the aqueous medium basicity order of n-links okay now here uh, like similarly nh3 here R is equal to ethyl, then it is ethylamine, diethylamine, triethylamine. 
prietile amine. This is the best base. I simply discuss it as a prietile amine tea. So in my lab, laboratory, organic laboratory, this is a commonly used uh, base. Okay, that is the TEA. Triethyl amine. This is the base. Okay. Now here, a triethyl amine means here it is the like a ethyl group. Here it is the ethyl group. Here it is the ethyl group. This is the like a hydrogen atoms. Hydrogen over there, hydrogen over there. These are the hydrogen atoms. Okay. Now here it is the like a hydrogen, 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 hydrogen. Here it is the hydrogen, 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 hydrogen. Okay, so this is the huge structure. That means uh, more steric inherence is observed. So the, due to the more steric inherence, uh, it cannot do, it cannot donate as much of the like a more more donating nature. That that means uh, it cannot act as a much more basic nature. So that's why instead of tertiary groups, secondary is more st more basic than that of the tertiary. Okay, so this is the simple order. So like the slightly changing order. Secondary is more basic than that of the tertiary, rather than that of the like primary. Then finally, ether. Ethyl, uh, simply it is methyl, uh, sorry, amine. Okay, so this is the order in presence of uh, aqueous media. This is the order in presence of aqueous media. Okay, so this is the like a uh, secondary greater than that of the tertiary, tertiary greater than that of the primary, primary greater than that of the ammonia in presence of ethyl groups. Why? Because triethylamine is the liquid compound that is aqueous solution. Okay, it is in the aqueous medium. Now let's move on to the like another topic, like a fifth application, sorry, sixth application that is the reactivity of. Uh, Halides, the activity of halides. Okay, now here in the presence of sixth application, the reactivity of alkyl halides, alkyl halides. Now, what will happen in case of a reactivity of alkyl halides? So, here it is the like tertiary alkyl halide, here it is the like a secondary alkyl halide, here it is the like a pri uh, primary alkyl halide, this is methyl to hydrogens, here it is the like methyl halide. Okay, now here all are the methyl groups. Like a simply unknown, uh, like empty compounds are methyl groups. So now here tertiary alkyl halide, the secondary, primary methyl alkyl halide. Okay, now here in presence of tertiary alkyl halide, here it is the more number of plus i groups. Okay, so if in case of more number of plus i groups are there, it donates the more number of electronic cloud. So here it is the more electronic cloud, more electron cloud so in presence of more electron cloud here halogen having the more electron activity in nature so that's why here it having the like more electrons so due to the electronic electronic repulsion between the carbocation and the halogen so it is readily breaks okay it readily breaks so tertiary alkyl halide readily breaks. Why? Because here it is the like a more more electronic electronic repulsion is observed. So that's why it is the more uh, more uh, reactive towards the like uh, something like a nucleophilic substitution. You know, those type of substitution reaction. So that's why tertiary uh, in similar way secondary greater than the primary greater than that of the methyl halide. Okay. So this is the order regarding to the like sixth. Okay. Now let's move on to the another application. So that is a. Uh, like a seventh application that is nothing but dipole moment. So here a uh, dipole moment uh, increases the like here seventh application dipole moment. Okay. Now here it is the uh, like a methyl iodide, like a methyl bromide, methyl chloride, methyl chloride. Sorry, it is the chloride. Now here the dipole moment of these compounds here it is approximately 1.65. Okay, 1.64 uh, dipole moment. Here 1.79 dipole moment. Here 1.83 dipole moment. Okay. Now here order of the like minus i effect is. Uh, Fluorine greater than that of the chlorine greater than that of the bromine greater than that of the iodine. Okay, this is the order. Okay, now here uh, chlorine is more uh, than that of the bromine, bromine is greater than that of the iodine. Now, here if the chlorine is more minus i effect, more inductive effect is present, uh, then dipole moment is also more. Okay, so simple thing is uh, like a more inductive effect, uh, more dipole moment, more dipole moment. This is the count, this is the simplest thing regarding to the eighth application that is dipole moment. Now, let's move on to the final thing. Acidity of some of the inorganic acids. Acidity of some of the inorganic uh, compounds, inorganic acids. Now here it is the like HF, HCl, HBr, HA. Okay. Now absolutely, which is more acidic in nature? Now, many of the students uh, they did in the wrong answer. They uh, they are given in the wrong answer. Why? Because uh, so fluorine is more electronegative. That's why it is completely more acidic in nature. But uh, originally it is wrong. Why? Because so HF top to bottom like uh, size of the molecule increases. Size of the molecule increases. Then distance between the molecule increases. Okay. So if more distance uh, readily breaks. So that means more distance between the bonded atoms. So it readily breaks. It readily breaks. So now here it is the more distance. Uh, it readily breaks. And then it readily donates their proton. Readily donates the 
proton. So which compound readily donates their protons? Those are the more acidic in nature. So that's why acidity order like this. HI greater than that of the HBr greater than that of the HCl greater than that of the HO. So their conjugate basic order is reverse. That means here it is the like a fluorine is greater than that of the. This is the acidity order. This is the basicity order. Fluorine is greater than that of the chlorine, is greater than that of the bromine, is greater than that of the iodine. So this is the basicity order. Like in similarly, like H2O, H2S, H2SE. Okay. Now here it is more electron negative, it's more acidic. That's wrong. Okay. So H2, H2SE is more acidic than that of the H2S, which is more acidic than that of the H2O, which is more acidic than that of the H2. But in case of like a CH4 compound, CH4, NH3, like a, then after OH2, HF. So left to right, now here it is the like electronegativity factor, left to right electronegativity increases, so it readily loses their protons, now here it is the acidity harder, this is the quite up. Why? Because here left to right size will be reduced, size will be reduced, okay? Now this is the order, okay? So this is the order uh, regarding to the, like many of the uh, plus i and minus i effects, plus i and minus i effects, okay? That's all for this video, this is the like many of the applications regarding to the inductive effect uh, as well as their introduction of the inductive effect in uh, covalent bond, that means electronic displacement effect in covalent bond, this is the permanent effect, why? Because it is caused in the, due to the polarization, okay? Uh, that's all for this video, thank you so much for watching, if you like the video, please share, like and comment the, com comment in comment box, thank you so much for watching.